is if I'm using a subdomain and suppose my Google Ads account gets suspended, all right, then in this case, can I run ads using different Google Ads account or other subdomains? The impact of suspension is on the subdomain or the main domain. So it's not about the impact on the subdomain or the main domain. If you as an account holder get suspended from Google and if you start creating new accounts and new websites and so on, you are likely to be suspended again because Google knows that it's you who's trying again. Otherwise, everybody, when they get suspended, they just open up a new account and get started again. So that's what we, uh, that's what we, uh, this is going to happen. So what you want to do is first of all, not to get suspended. And if, even if you do get suspended, work with Google and try to get your account back because it will be very difficult for you to get your new accounts approved because you will, you will find that you cannot run Google Ads. Now, if you've got certain things on your website where Google does not approve, then you need to make all the changes. So things like if you're selling things which are not approved by Google, things like guns or drugs or some um, uh, COVID-related uh, items which they don't, and there are quite a few. Uh, things which Google will not approve of, then you need to follow the Google's policies and get those uh, removed or create a new campaign and a new website and then get started. But the main domain will not have any effect uh, to answer your question, will not have any effect because it's on a subdomain. So we also run all our Google Ads campaign on offer dot sfdigital.co.uk and not on www and our account has never been suspended yes once in a while in fact a few years ago our account our ads were disapproved kept getting disapproved because of a malware on our website which somebody had uh, put in and we had to get our site cleaned up before the ads got approved again